welcome to Grimsby Town Seb. Thank you. How's your pre-season preparations going so far? Um, yeah, um, it was it's going good. I was I travelled down last night and got here in the evening, and then today is my first training session. Is that like, yeah, it was tough, but it was a good experience. You met your teammates last night for the first time. How was that? Uh, yeah, as I said, I travelled down last night and then met up with a few of the lads, and yeah, they're all welcoming. And then in the morning, like at training, I met up with the rest of them, and yeah, it was they were all welcoming and they made me feel very welcome. Yeah. For those that are unfamiliar with you, describe yourself as a player. Um, well, I'm a, a left back who likes to get forward and also a very good 1v1 defender. And yeah, I like to attack and get balls into box and hopefully get lots of assists. You played all games for Villa in the Football League trophy last season. Has the prospect of first team men's football made the move to Grimsby more appealing? Uh, yeah, like, I, I like to get a lot of minutes um, for a men's team, get to know the men's game. So when Grimsby came in, I was very interested and in so uh, I feel like it will be a good club for my development and to get more used to the professional men's game. OK, so we've signed uh, Seb from Aston Villa. We've got him on a season-long loan deal. Uh, he's a player that I watched towards the end of last season uh, and that we were made aware of. He was part of the FA Youth Cup winning team and you know that's no sort of mean achievement. I watched the semi-final and the final. I think it was West Brom and, and Liverpool that they beat and he certainly impressed in those games as in fairness did a lot of his teammates but given um, you know the fact we've only really got Adam Crooks as a recognised left back we're always looking for a, another player to come in and add competition. I think Seb's uh, a different type to to Adam, and you know it might be that both could end up playing in the same side as well. He, he's certainly a, a left back, but we feel, and he, I know he has done at times, played up one. So there's a, a possibility of that, and also you know Crooksy can play left side centre back um, as well. Maybe if we change formation there. That's another option, but he's, you know, he's only just turned 18, but he's been involved with the England youth teams. He's, he's a very athletic player that gets up and down the pitch well and, and got good delivery. So, you know, he'll add competition to the squad and, you know, we're excited about him. We feel that a, a full season um, will help the player develop. We've done that with players in the past, you know, particularly uh, I guess another left back that we did that with uh, was Connor Townsend, uh, having two spells and Connor's gone on uh, strength to strength and uh, you know still in the middle of a, a very good career. Hopefully we can do the same sort of thing for Seb. Um, his first week has, has coincided with has coming to Mottram Hall. Uh, you know really good facilities here, a uh, good pitch, uh, nice surroundings, and you know really grateful for the support from, from Jason and Andrew to allow us to, to come here and break the seven week pre-season up a little bit. Um, you know, we're almost in, in the middle of it now. Started playing the games, um, obviously more games to come, but this is, you know, probably be a, a tough week and then it'll just start to taper off slightly. Um, trying to keep people fit, we had a few niggles, uh, but hopefully nothing too serious. Uh, to add to, I guess, a couple of injuries that we, we have had uh, with, with Lenny and, and Ryan in particular. Uh, but it was nice to come here on the back of a, a good performance at the weekend and playing back in front of the fans. So really pleased uh, with our pre-seasons going so far and, you know, we carry on planning and, and still looking for one or two more additions. Um, when they'll happen, I'm not too sure, but we uh, we continue to look as we try and put a you know, a really competitive squad together.